ahead on Daytime Buffalo. Wedding week rolls on as we have the ever so sweet platters chocolates in the studio. We'll show you how you can bring some sweet treats to your ceremony and how it can be custom tailored to your taste. And 26 Shirts is in the house to show off their latest design where you can grab one while they are still available and how it goes to help a great cause. It's all coming up right here on Daytime Buffalo. Good afternoon, hello, and welcome to Daytime Buffalo. I'm your host, Chelsea Lavelle. The week is just flying by and we are having a blast. From wedding cakes to dresses to venue spaces, we here at Buffalo have you covered for your big day. And today, it's no different. Joining me in the studio today is Flatter's Chocolates with Vice President Heidi Urban and Custom Orders and Corporate Gifts Manager Kathy Labber. Th ladies, thank you so much for coming in. Thank you so much for having us. Now, I want to know a little bit about the history of Platters, because uh, you guys have some really cool stories. We really, we do. We uh, we started 85 years ago, so this year we're celebrating 85 years in business. Congratulations. Is, thank you so much. Um, and it started in the basement of a house. So the basement of the house, Mr. Platter, or Carl Platter himself, started the business with him and his wife, Vera. Um, it's been in the urban family for almost 50 years. So wow. when my father-in-law had purchased the business from Mr. Platter, we've moved around to Oliver Street. We've also most recently moved into the space in 2016 at the Wurlitzer building, yes. where we are today. That's right. I visited your facility during my wake up days. I had a great time running around the chocolate factory <laughs> and seeing how it's all made. Tell me a little bit more about the facility because it's a great place. Yeah, thank you so much. Yeah, we love it there. So we were able to um, go into the building and really make it our own space. So we've built out almost 40,000 square feet you know, much of it is production space because we do make all of our uh, candies in-house. But we also have not just a chocolate shop, but a cafe where we have ice cream and coffees, bubble teas, and you know, anything that, you know, you want to come in and relax by the fireplace, uh, bring your friends in there, your baseball team, sit around and enjoy company. It's, it's a really great space. And even ice cream, right? Because that's my favorite sweet. <laughs> yeah. I love chocolate, but I love some ice cream. <laughs> and talk about how what, what that did for the community, because that building had a lot of history, and then it was just sitting there for a long time, right? It really was. It's, uh, the building was built in the late 1800s, and it, when we moved in, it was, um, I don't want to say vacant, it did have a lot in there, but when once we moved in, it has really grown. We've had some wonderful neighbors that have um, moved into the spaces next to us, the Tattered Tulip, Woodcock Brewery, Fatty Beer, the events at the Wurlitzer, so a venue that you can host weddings. Um, it's, and the space is amazing. The community um, comes there for community, and I use that word, it's a sense of community that really has evolved around us being able to open up our space there. Well, speaking of weddings, we are celebrating wedding week, and you guys really have some unique things you can offer to a ceremony, including a candy station. Talk to me a little bit about oh, that. The candy station is becoming so popular. Yeah. Um, Anytime anybody wants a favor, they call in. I always mention that we do candy stations also. This is just a small sample of what we have, a couple of our different dishes and plater, platters and plates that we use. Um, they don't know that we can always do shortbread cookies and chocolate-covered Oreo cookies. We have bakers, very, very good bakers in our store that decorate all these cookies for us. We do all customized um, pretzels, sponge candies. This is our famous bit right here, um, anything that they want. They don't realize that anything in our store can be turned into a favor. Yeah, all so, these favors, so cute. You've got, my chips. favorite is the wedding dress we do right wedding here. Gowns. This is we so do cute. We everything, and, and I know it's wedding week, <laughs> but we go from doing bachelorettes to doing bridal showers to doing weddings to doing baby showers. <laughs> All so, the in between, you can do it all. And that's right. Someone, everyone at an event likes right. something sweet, right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll travel to where your destination is, you know, and we'll set it up. We'll break it down, and we'll just provide what they need. And talk to me about some recent events you guys have been a part of. Yeah. So um, we've just been in a couple of the bridal shows. We were down at the convention center. We were just at Riverworks. Um, we have a couple more that are coming up this month, actually, um, on Sunday, and then again in a couple of weeks. And it is kind of surprising when I say, oh, have you heard of platters? And some people say, no, we haven't. 
they're not aware that we are in this grand building in the North Towns. So then I get the phone calls, where are you, how do I get there, they want to come in. So everybody comes into the store, we take a walk around, pick out the flavors they like, the candies they like, and we go from there. And you guys kind of can custom make to whatever flavor the customer wants, right? So we have milk chocolate, orange chocolate, our favorite, and the dark chocolate. So those are the customarily the ones that we will cover their pretzels in, we'll decorate them the way they like, we try to customize their colors and their, their special favors. So, Do you guys have any events coming up? Um, the bridal show, so we have one on Sunday. I'm gonna be out at a winery nice. up in the North Towns and then I will be out in Niagara Falls at the Hyatt Place um, at the end of the month um, that we'll have a candy station set up and of course we will give samples. I wanna so. know what your favorite candy is. From the experts, this is a big question. <laughs> so I have a hard thing with that because every morning I walk in, I'm just like, oh, it smells, smells so good. So good. Yeah. I know. And I look over yeah. at the production line and I'm like, oh, they're doing peanut butter. <laughs> so when it's peanut butter, I'm at the end of the line, just. Yeah, just tasting away. Yeah, yeah, that's it, that's it. That's so funny. And I, I'll chime in on this. My favorite changes with the season because every season will make a little specialty for that season. So we've got these amazing peanut butter um, crate eggs right now that are to die for. Nice. Um, and at Christmas time, we've got a peppermint puff. We've got, yeah, so mm -hmm. um, my favorite changes. Oh. <laughs> so anything new coming up besides those eggs? Oh, do you have more eggs? Because obviously Easter's coming up not too far away from that. Yeah, Easter, this is our time to, to grind, I guess you'd say. Yeah. So we've got, a, you know, our, our store looks beautiful. It's amazing, fully stocked. We're ready to, to be uh, a part of everybody's Easter tradition. So we're yeah. looking forward to tasting these. Yeah. If anyone would like to get in touch with you guys, if they have an event coming up, how can they get into contact with you? Yeah, so they can visit our website at platterschocolates.com. Um, there's a custom orders uh, space on the website, but there's also an events tab too. So some of the events that Kathy mentioned are going, you'll find those events um, right on our website as well. Very nice, okay. Well, we have all the information. If you would like to learn more about Platter's Chocolates, what they offer, or even just take a tour of how they do it, just head on over to their website at platterschocolates.com. Thank you, ladies, for coming in. Thank, Thank you. you. Coming up after the break, we've got For Goodness Cakes Up next for a look into their incredible nonprofit and how they connect kids with cake. And we aren't finished with weddings yet. We've got a unique and independent way to get hitched in the 716. Keep it here, that's next.